there's really no other vehicle or truck out that has this large of a hydrogen storage system. I'm here with Christian from Nikola. What really caught my attention was we see like a very long haul vehicle. This is our fuel cell electric truck. And the range of this truck is up to 800 kilometers. So it really covers, you know, most of the regional haul applications. And we also have our battery electric truck. And that truck has a range of up to 500 kilometers. I'm interested in both what's happening right. electric and right. what's happening fuel cell. So sure. uh, I, I don't see any fuel cell filling stations around my neighborhood. Yes. So how's that working? Out? Absolutely, great question. So we have five tanks on the vehicle, 70 kilograms of hydrogen, and there's really no other vehicle or truck out there right now that has this large of a hydrogen storage system capacity. And so you're absolutely right. We need to build out the infrastructure with it. It doesn't work without the supply. It doesn't work without the demand. So we have to, you know, get, get both scaled up at the same time. So we have our modular refueling solutions. You could say it's a refueling station on a, on a trailer on wheels. Yes. And then what we do is we build these out first before we build out permanent stations. We're doing a lot of this with, with partners as well. So just recently, we officially opened our first modular station in Southern California. And what we do there, it's essentially two fueling units that we have, and we can uh, fuel anywhere between 40 and 50 trucks per day with those solutions. And then we're also partnering in terms of permanent stations, for example, with First Element Fuel in Northern California. So we're using their station that they just opened and specifically built for heavy duty applications. And then we're doing it similar in a similar way here, here in Canada. We actually have one of those modular fueling assets already here in Toronto. Um, and then we have another one in uh, Alberta, in Edmonton. And so we're building out specific corridors with our partners um, here in Canada with ITD to utilize these modular assets um, and have them support the fueling, you know, until we get to the point where we can either ourselves or, you know, with partners or other industry players invest in permanent stations. We have to start somewhere. That's why we're focusing on specific markets, specific routes, where we know we have thousands of trucks running yeah. um, certain areas every day. Um, and we can just start with just one, two, three, and 10 fueling stations and just build up from there. 350 kilowatt charging is what we're using with the truck at the moment. We have uh, 738 kilowatt hours capacity in the battery electric truck, total capacity. And so, you know, it takes, if you're talking a typical, you know, 10 to, to 80 charge or something, it, it takes about 90 minutes or so with the 350 kilowatt charging. I suspect the vehicle's more, much more expensive. I know what it costs to put a 350 kilowatt yeah. and the timelines to yeah. do that. Yeah. This is quite an investment. And these fleets will not go in and say, all in and say, we're oh. gonna do our whole fleet, right? Everyone's dipping their toe into, wanna see, hey, hey, what can we do with it and learn how to operate these and so on. That's what we need. We just as an overall industry and with partners, we just have to drive for zero emission solutions and the decarbonization of this of this industry. The infrastructure is improving. And so we, we have many customers that want to try both the fuel cell and the battery. Oh. We have customers that are very set on the battery electric truck. We have others that are set on the fuel cell truck. So it really depends on your application, right? On the battery truck, if you're running one shift, and you can afford to charge overnight, well, then you don't need 350 kilowatt charger. It's really about zero emissions, one platform, and we have two powertrain options essentially, and it really comes down to, to the application, the region, the availability of you know the electrical power, the availability of hydrogen, and so we're always working with our customers to find really the best fit for their application. I'm very excited about this. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.